On today's Shortcut Quilt episode, we're making the Jelly Roll Twist. The Hop, Skip, and a Jump fabric collection just fits this quilt to a T. And all you need is one Moda Jelly Roll and one Moda Solid Charm Pack. It's a cinch to make, so download the free pattern at Fat Corner Shop and let's get sewing. Start unrolling your Jelly Roll and select your favorite 34 prints. From your stack, select two Jelly Roll strips and we're gonna go to our sewing machine and stitch with a quarter inch seam allowance and today, I'm using Aurifil Color 2000. Now we're gonna press and I'm gonna set my seam with lots of steam before pressing to one side I like to use a really, really hot iron with lots of steam. Finger press to one side. And then you're gonna guide the edge of your iron right on that seam. You're gonna make 17 of these. They're gonna go together in a flash. Now, let's go cut. Now we're gonna take 11 of these strip sets and we're gonna make our long piece units. The first thing I'm gonna do is line up my Creative Grids ruler and I'm gonna use a line on the ruler to put right on the seam and I'm gonna trim. So I get a really nice even cut. And then I'm gonna use the lines on my ruler, not my mat, to cut a nine inch rectangle. And here I'm lining up the edge with the nine inches and this entire line with my seam. I'm gonna cut two from this side. And then I'm gonna cut two from the other side because I do not like to use the middle because it's wavy. So I'm just gonna repeat on the other side. You're gonna get four long piece units from each strip set and you're gonna make a total of 42. From our remaining strip sets, we're gonna make our short piece units and from each strip set, you're gonna make seven five inch rectangles. And again, we're gonna stop on the end and use the same technique, except when I get to this wavy part, I'm gonna start over because I don't wanna use the center. Now if you get uneven where things are starting to be wavy and this won't line up, what I would do is just start another straight edge, turn over, and keep cutting. Now you can see now we're in the middle and we are getting wavy, so I'm gonna start over on the other end. And that's what's great about using these jelly rolls is you've got a lot of room to just start over by trimming back up and starting again. You're gonna make a total of 42 short piece units. So now we're ready to put together our blocks and it's coming together really quick. You're gonna take a short piece unit and a fabric B square and stitch them together. And this is what you're gonna get. You're gonna press toward the white. Then you're going to take a long piece unit and add it to the top and bottom. Stitch with a quarter inch seam. And ta-da, you've got your twist block. Make 42. We're gonna start assembling our rows and you're gonna twist your blocks as you go. And just have fun. It's gonna be a scrappy quilt. You know, some fabrics may touch and that is just okay. Now each row is gonna have six blocks and you're gonna make seven rows. The Jelly Roll Twist is so fun and easy, it makes a great gift. I can't wait to see all of your Jelly Roll Twist quilts. So hashtag Jelly Roll Twist and like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you next time.